Wait, what happened to Lucian and Elytra? Did they seriously run? And leave me behind? I'm going to absolutely slap that man. I can't slap Elytra, but... Uh, who's around here then? Before I talk to the guard and probably have my arm ripped off. Yarl decided I was too much of a problem. Threw me in here with the force war. Wait, what? Really? I got locked up one too many times. Now I'm in for life. What exactly are you in for? The first time, thieving. The second time, thieving. The third time, thieving. It kind of keeps going like that. So you basically didn't learn your lesson after thieving the first time. And you get going and going and going. You've been in here for a while, haven't you? First it was six months. Then a year. Then two years. Now I'm in for life. Uh... I mean, I did a bit of fever in my, in my young, younger days. Speaking of that, I was I'm still young. Um. Look, um, one of the guys in the other room, they said that you had a shiv. I kind of need one. Ah, you want protection? I can get you what you need. Maybe you could do something for me first. Duok has a bottle of skooma. Finest distilled moon sugar. I'm shaking just thinking about it. You want me to get it for you? Thank you, friend. Don't worry. I'll have that shiv ready for you. All right, then. Okay. How am I meant to get this, then? I could sneak up and steal it from his pockets, at least. Jarl decided I was too much of a problem. Yeah, you already said that, Threw my me friend. in here with the force wall. Hi! I was sent here because someone said I was a Forsworn. That's it? You- they just said that you were a Forsworn and that's it? You were plopped in here? Guards say I murdered someone. I was just sleeping off some meat in my aunt's house. That didn't stop him from arresting me. I don't even know who they said I killed. So you're another innocent. How long have you been in here? A couple of years. I wasn't a forsworn when I came, but I joined up when I got in. Easier that way. I guess. Yeah. Good day. Oh, they're gonna make me... If I... How... I'm gonna be doomed if I join them, though. Surely I'd be doomed. Did they say how's the skooma? I left behind my daughter Not you. Wale when I was taken. Uh, I don't really have that ma that heavy pockets like. I could mine up the silver and run with it, especially if I get out. That's tempting. I am gonna pick up this pickaxe though. Me too. Can't blame me. If someone attacks me, I'm definitely swinging them. Those... There are ruins or something. Hi. Other prisoners get suspicious when we talk to each other, so keep it down. Sure, uh... Voice is going very quiet. What are you in for? I'm a Forsworn. One of our raids went bad and I got captured. Would have been fine dying for the Reach with my kinsmen, but the Silver Bloods want their ore mine, so they threw me in here. How long have you been in here then? Year seven, I think. Surprised I haven't cut my own throat out by now, but something keeps me going. Uh, I'm gonna be, I'm so doomed to the moment I ask this. Um, I hear you have Scootma. You give me one more look, and I cut you open. 
That schooner's mine. Uh, it may be, it, it, it is yours, yes, but I really need some. <laughs> Badly. You know, fellow addict. I could, uh, I could do with some really badly. Getting the shakes, huh? Yeah. All right, take it. Old gods keep you. My thanks, friend. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> I've not done that kind of acting in a long while. I'm surprised you fell for that, actually. But it worked. Actually, was there anyone else down there? Thanks for the skooma. I didn't say that out loud. There was no one else down here. Huh, thanks. Oops, I need to keep my mouth shut a little bit. Just a little bit. Hey, where's that guy? If I can get that shiv. Beats carrying around. Jarl decided I was too much of a problem. Threw me in here with the Force War. I got locked up one too many times. Now I'm in for life. And now you have some skooma. Here's your shiv. Promise you won't ever use it on me, okay? Ideally, I hope not to. But thank you. All right, then. Okay, where's that shiv? Well, it's a little bit more subtle than what I had. Her pickaxe, at least. Damn it, what do I do now? Because there's no way I'm getting out this way. I don't even have a lock pick on me. Oh shit, she's coming back. I better move, otherwise she's gonna punch my face. She's got that look on her that says, Nope, I'm going to hit you if you cause any trouble down there, little elf. I left behind my daughter, Uale, when I was taken. He is the only one I haven't talked to, and he's the one who rips people's arms off and slaps them with it. How old is my daughter now, I wonder? In prison, you lose track of time. I mean, you don't even see the sun, so that makes sense. The new meat. So soft. Tender. What was it like killing your first one, huh? Oh, you mean my first kill. Um, well, I'm not exactly a killer. Well, I mean, you can't exactly go about walking the world in that lot without having to run into a few people who end up wanting to try and kill you yourself, so I'm more just like a defend defending myself. I'm not exactly a murderer. Liar. I mean, I'm... Okay, I might be a little bit. <laughs> a, a tiny bit. Sort of. What are you in for? Murder, banditry, assault, theft, and lollygagging. L lollygagging? Lolly lollygagging. Okay, right, yep. That's. I'm glad I didn't mention my um, habit of burning bandits. Uh, how long have you been in here? Guards brought me in about 12 years ago. Was running a good group of bandits up until then. But these Forsworn, they're nothing like the men I cobbled together. They're real killers. Real? Yeah, well... Well, they are trying to bake an uprise and reclaim their land, so yeah. Um... Look, um... Brock or the Beast. <laughs> I uh, need to see Madanak. You want to talk to the king in rags? Fine. But first you gotta pay the toll. The toll? How about you get me a shiv? Not that I need one, but it's nice to have one in case I need to do some shaving. <laughs> you don't have a beard? Um. But, uh. 
I'm almost certain Madanak is probably expecting me. Kind of, maybe. The only thing Madanak expects is a bottle of skooma in tribute ever so often. You're not getting through. Ah, oh, fine, here's your shiv. All right, head on in. But don't try anything in there. Madanak is smarter than you think. If he was smarter, I'm pretty certain he would be out of the jails by now. Until next time. Uh, so long as you don't stab me with that shiv. I practically just made myself. You serve your time by digging. Yeah. So dig. Yeah. Yeah. I've not even dug once yet, so I'm not helping them one bit. Where is he again? Oh, that's a dead body. Can I not pick? Oh, I should be at pick lock that, but I don't have my lock picks. Oh, oh hi, you are in the luxury. You even got a bloody well, rabbit well, down here. Well, look at you. The Nords have turned you into an animal. A wild beast caged up and left to go mad. I mean, being in here, well, I won't go well, mad. Look, well, well, look at you. So, my fellow beast, what do you want? Answers about the Forsworn? Revenge for trying to have you killed? I mean, I quite happily would start with the revenge, but I'm not that type of person. Much. Because I've had quite a few people come and try and kill me, actually. I do want my freedom, though. But you have a lot to answer for. Do I? What about you? What right did you have to meddle in my affairs? Kill my people? Was it worth it? Your truth? You're one of us now, you see? A slave. I am no one's slave. The boot of the Nord stepping on your throat. Maybe if you understood that, I could help you. Why exactly would you help me? Firstly, I'm no one's slave. Secondly, the Nords are just Nords. I practically saw that in Windhelm. Sort of, but some of them are good people. Not all of them, but some of them. What do you mean by making me understand, exactly? There's a man named Bregg inside these mines. Besides me, he's been here the longest. Tell him I sent you. Ask him why he's here. I want you to know how widespread the injustice of Markarth is. Uh, Alright, fine. I'll hear Bragg's story, but... I want to know about Fauna. I had Markarth. My men and I drove the Nords out. We had won. So we thought. Retribution was swift. I was captured, quickly tried, and sentenced to death. But my execution never came. Thonar's silver blood stopped it. He wanted the Forsworn at his call, that I would point their rage at his enemies and spare his allies. And I have. Humiliating at first, but I knew he would let his guard down eventually, that he would come to trust I was under control. A long but yeah, it's kind of a good tactic, I'll give you that. Just that. And the Forsworn, I've got questions about them. This was our land. We were here first. Then the Nords came and put chains on us, forbid us from worshipping our gods. Some of us refused to bow. We knew the old ways would lead us back to having a kingdom of our own. That is who we are. The Forsworn. Criminals in our own lands, and we will cut a bloody hole into the reach until we are free. Wait, 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 wait. The Nords came, took your lands. That bit, I can understand where you'd want the revenge from. But the Nords started forbidding you from worshipping your god. And the Nords are currently at war with the 
bloody empire because the empire people wanted to stop the Nords from worshipping their own god. Ha! <laughs> okay, well you've made me see one thing, that's for good. That's for certain. Remember, it was the Nords who locked you up. Yeah. I am severely not liking the Nords at all now. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> I just, I just want to laugh at the aspect of it. <laughs> okay, maybe I am going a bit insane. Um, I need to find Brig. I left behind my. Uh. No, you're not him. Are you Brig? No, you're Odvan. Odvan. Oh, there was more here. Was Are you Brig? Brig? Hi. Don't reach for a shiv around me, or we'll both regret it. I don't even have one on me at this point. I don't even have the pickaxes. I threw them away. What do you want? Of digging to do. Madonna asked me to hear your story. My story, huh? Everyone in Sidna Mine has a tale. Let's hear yours first. When was the first time you felt chains around your wrists? Truth be told, first time I felt them, I was young. Like, yeah, I was kind of young. Like, barely my twenties young. Then you know the hard looks as judgment gets set upon you. The sneers of people who never had to face sentence. Do you have any family? Anyone waiting for you on the outside? I mean, I've got friends. They're the only family I really need. My actually, actual family is not actually in Skyrim either. Not that I consider them family much. I have friends though. Yeah. Yeah, I have friends. I had a daughter once. She'd be 23 this year. Married to some hot-headed silver worker or maybe on her own learning the herb trade. The Nords didn't care who was and who wasn't involved in the forsworn uprising. I had spoken to Modenak once. That was enough. But my little Aethra didn't want to see her papa leave her. She pleaded to the Jarl to take her instead. And after they made me watch as her head rolled off the block, they threw me in here anyway to dig up their silver. Bloody hells. Really, I, I am. I'm sorry. My daughter is the one who needs your pity. I'm just a poor forsworn whose only regret is not killing more Nords before I was locked up. Thanks for telling me, Brig. Mm -hmm. I seriously don't know what side to be on. At one side, I hate the Nords. On the other side... It's just a Nords being Nords. I don't know what side to be on. Though at this point I don't think I've got much choice. Okay, right, um... Focus, at this point I, I just need to survive. Ugh. Hey. So I spoke to him. That's definitely one way you of making me the see. Sun? Because you'll forget. Soon. You're back. Have you done what I asked? Ugh, yes, you don't need to shout, you know. Yeah, imagine hearing a story like that over and over. Each time a different family, each time a different injustice. Your meddling above ground reminded me of how removed I've been from the struggle. My men and I should be in the hills, fighting. 
So, you'll help me escape then? Yes, but I need a show of loyalty from you. Oh, of course you do. I don't need a shiv in the back while we break out. Have you met Grisvar the Unlucky? He's rightly named, and he's also a thief and a snitch. He's outlived his minor usefulness. Take care of him, and then we can leave Sitna Mine for good. I don't even have a shift. Ah, Borko muscle one out of you on your way in? Fine. Take this one. Our vengeance will come. Thanks. I could so stab this shiv into his back. You're a slave, just like us. I'm not a slave. I, I, I'm, I'm not a slave. I will never be a slave. No one is ever putting me in chains. Nor trapping me. Or calling me a slave. Oh, I don't want to kill this guy. I got locked up one too many times. Now I'm in for life. I don't want to... I'm sorry. What? No! No, don't kill me! Please! What was that? What was that? Please! Don't kill me! Well, I must have run off. Ah, uh, I'm sorry. I was only a thief. Taking your ship, the other ship. I was as well. sent here because some. I'm having said two. I was a forceful. So I can step both into Madden Nuts back. Maybe. Maybe. Alright, he's dead. You're back! Have you done what I asked? Stop shouting at me. You're a slave, just like us! I'm not a slave. I've said this before like a million times. I really want Lucian right now. Griswold's dead. You finally become one of us. Not willingly. Come with me. I think it's time I announced my plans to you and your new brothers. Sure, new plans. Yeah. Wait, what plans? Oh no, what have I just what have I just done? What's going on, Madinok? You wouldn't have old Grisvar killed unless you weren't planning on needing him. My brothers, we have been here long enough. It's time to leave Sidna Mine and continue our fight against the Nords. Through this gate, just beside my quarters, is a tunnel. A tunnel that leads right through the old dwarven ruins of Markarth, into the city. Well, what do you say, my brothers? The Reach belongs to the Force Wall! He knew of a way out. I say you've earned an early pardon. Let's go. He knew of a way out. Already, and he's not even thought about take, taking it. Why did he wait? Why did he wait? Uh, I, I don't... I, okay, maybe I have lost my marbles. Where did this tunnel come from exactly? It's a little gift from the dwarves. Who knew they would end up helping our cause? We have to move. We'll talk more once we see the sky. And when I say hi to Lucian and run for my life. Maybe. Uh, well, this is going to be bloody. Very bloody. Oh, not gonna like this.